Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is the Deck Review. Hey, today we're gonna look at the Bloodlines deck from Billy French and the United States Playing Card Company. All right, so what is Bloodlines? Bloodlines was a Kickstarter project. It was successfully funded and this is the deck. Uh, the Bloodlines deck was inspired, uh, takes its name from uh, the traditional deck of playing cards. You have four royal families, and when Billy French originally embarked on this design challenge, uh, he tasked himself with ensuring that the court cards in this set felt like they belonged together. So every family, get it? Family, Bloodlines, suits, all right. Have, they all have their own traits, and they all have their personalities. So what uh, Billy hopes is that you'll find a unique and refreshing take on your typical deck of cards. The tuck ace on this is really gorgeous. Uh, you got that red stock paper and then the gold metallic inks throughout. It's totally intricate. Could spend forever describing uh, to you uh, what it looks like, but you know what they say, a picture is worth a thousand words. The front of the tuck case said bloodlines and playing cards, and then, and then this side says bloodlines, this side says designed by Billy French. The bottom, of course, has some ad copy. The design on the top is very simple, but you do see a custom gold tuck seal. The back design is, of course, the back design of the cards. When you pop the tuck flap out, there's a little bit of intricate design work in there as well. And then you can see that it is a red stocked paper uh, throughout. And the two tiny little tongue flaps say good and luck. That is pretty much it for the tuck case. Let's take a look at these cards. These cards are printed from the United States Playing Card Company and they do come on their retail stock, borderline casino stock. It's right on the edge. It does have a modern cut and air cushion emboss. And if you'd like to learn more about stock cut or finish, you can click the link below in the description. These cards, when you measure 10 together on a caliper, comes to about 2.99, which is right on the edge of being casino grade, but still well within United States Playing Card parameters to be modern. So yeah, either way. Uh, and if you want to hold these decks, play with them, you're going to find that they feel a little bit like the Superior decks, or the Honeybees, or the Camp cards Dan and Dave released, or maybe even the Silver Gator backs. The back design is done in a kind of dried blood red burgundy color. Uh, you can see that it's a heart on the top and bottom, but together it kind of looks almost like an hourglass. Uh, there's some uh, wings in there, some, a little bit of flora, a little bit of fauna, and a nice architectural edge. With this deck, you're gonna get two wild cards, not necessarily jokers. Uh, they are animals, wolf-like creatures, that have a banner underneath each one that says wild card, and one is turquoise and the other is blood red. Also with this deck, you're gonna get an ad card that on the front face of it, it has billyfrenches.com. Also because this deck was a Kickstarter release, you will get a thank you that has been autographed from Billy French himself. And lastly, you will get a double backer as your gaff, which are always great for magic tricks. Your Ace of Spades is very clean, not a lot to it. Uh, just a big, fat, exploded pip in the center uh, in a field of turquoise, and then some random objects thrown in, including a skull. The pips and NC cards have been completely redrawn and redesigned. Uh, they're very small, very chunky, but they have a really cute uh, feel to them, but they'll instantly be recognizable to anyone playing cards. The court cards have a very unique, very stylized drawing to them. Billy French has a really creative, uh, kind of nouveau, very art deco, uh, style to his work. Uh, and again, you're going to see those same two colors, the turquoise, the blood red, um, very simple faces, but still very elegant. I think this is a striking and a very fun and fanciful deck of cards. All right, so that is the Bloodlines deck from Billy French and the United States Playing Card Company. As always, we ask that you like this video just so other people can find it faster. We also recommend that you subscribe to this channel just to stay up to date on the latest in cards and card magic. Hey, and if you want to follow me on social media, you can. I'm at facebook.com slash magic orthodoxy, twitter.com slash magic orthodoxy, instagram.com slash magic underscore orthodoxy. And if you need more content, you can always find it at magic orthodoxy.com. Thanks. Bye.